Hey there! Welcome to our walkthrough of the Upswing Writing Lab. This walkthrough is for current users of Upswing who may be curious about how the Writing Lab can supplement students in improving their writing abilities and achieving their learning goals. Let's take a look at the Writing Lab from the student perspective. I'll start by logging into Upswing from my school's login page. Once I log in, I see that I can access the Writing Lab through my dashboard. The Writing Lab was designed to help students through every stage of the writing process. Within each of these sections, we've made step-by-step -step video guides that contain detailed explanations and easy-to-understand examples for each topic. Since this is our first visit to the Writing Lab, let's click on the Writing Process to get an overview of how to use the Writing Lab and how to complete each stage of the writing process. This is a great place to start if you want to learn about the writing process or how to use a writing lab most effectively. The sound's not on right now, but I wanted to play the video so you get an idea of how these videos are formatted. All of the content in the writing lab is categorized under the four stages of the writing process. I see them in my left navigation bar. Again, since this is our first visit, let's start with the first stage, pre-writing. Here I see all of the topics covered under pre-writing. Now I could watch this in succession from left to right if I wanted to cover the content in a course-like format, or if I just wanted a refresher in one of the topics, I could just click on, let's say, brainstorming, and see that there are two videos that I would need to watch to know everything I need to know about brainstorming. Again, on the left, I see all of the subtopics covered under pre-writing. I also see the three other stages of the writing process. If I wanted to skip ahead to editing, I simply click on editing, and I'm taken to all of the subtopics covered under editing. So let's say I finish writing my paper. The next thing I need to do is create a bibliography and cite my sources. Lucky for me, the Writing Lab has me covered. If I click on Citations, I'm taken to the citation tool Cite Up. Now, this isn't a typical citation generator. What this tool allows me to do is to filter for the style of paper I'm writing and then find the specific citation format so that I can learn how to cite my sources. Let's take a look. Let's say that I'm writing an MLA style paper. I'll go ahead and filter for MLA as a style. I know my source is from a book, so I'll click on book. I see that I still have a lot of options, so let's filter down a little bit more. I know that my book was written by two authors, so I'll click on two under authors, and I see the correct formatting for my citation. Here I can copy and paste this formatting and input my information I can also see an example. The citation tool was made so that students understand how they format their sources. So every citation in CiteUp has an example, and it also has more information on why they cite something a certain way. The last feature of the Writing Lab is Assignment Review, or what we like to call Ask Up. Ask Up is the final step in refining my essay, and it allows me to submit my assignment for review by a writing coach. Once I submit my assignment, my paper will be claimed within 48 hours, and I'll receive a review from a writing coach on how to improve my essay. To take a look at how this works, we'll look under current submissions. So this is a paper that I've already submitted, and I can see in the status that it's been approved. To check my activity, I'll click on View and Activity and see that my coach Mitch has already attached my review. To view my review, I'll click on the attachment and click to open. Once I open this review, I see that Mitch has written me a personalized review of my essay that contains my strengths and areas that need more attention. 
This isn't a proofread or edited version of my essay. It allows me as a student to see what needs development and make those corrections myself. Thanks for watching this walkthrough of the Upswing Writing Lab. If you have any questions, please reach out to us at speak at upswing.io.